woman now charged in a horrific crash that claimed her friend's life. Prosecutors say that last year, Emily McGovern was drunk and driving more than 100 miles per hour when she rolled her car on 495 in Haverhill. WBZ's Jim Smith was in court today. A horrific scene on Route 495 in Haverhill in March of 2018. Two young women from Methuen pinned in a badly wrecked and overturned Lincoln. One of them killed. Today, the woman police say was driving was in court. Prosecutors saying Emily McGovern, now 20 years old, was drunk and speeding at the time of the crash. There was data that was pulled from the event data recorder from that Lincoln that revealed that the Lincoln was traveling at 107 miles an hour, 1.5 seconds prior to the crash. The victim was 18-year-old Alexis Sparts, who was taken to a nearby hospital where she was pronounced dead. Her mother was in court with friends and family. The, the process is just so long, it's a little bit frustrating, and I just want justice for my daughter, and I just, I miss her so much, so obviously you can see all her friends are here, like, just trying to support me and my family, um, but I hope justice is served. According to court paperwork, police initially thought Sparts was the driver of the vehicle because it was flipped. Emily McGovern's lawyer says that's part of his case. My contention is we simply don't know, and, and therein lies reasonable doubt. Uh, if the initial report, based on the ambulance records, the medical records, the initial firefighters, that my client is the passenger, then by definition she can't be guilty. But we have to sort that out, and right now I just don't know. Emily McGovern was released on personal recognizance. She was ordered not to drive and to remain drug and alcohol free with screenings. She's due back in court in August at Haverhill District Court. Jim Smith, WBZ News.